A suburban mom attacked in her Libertyville driveway in February is talking for the first time about the terrifying moments when thieves got away with her car and her two-year-old in the back seat. CBS 2's Chris Ty spoke with a woman today about the lawsuit she's now filing against her car manufacturer. Chris. That's right, Jim and Marie Taylor Shepard, fresh from the pet store, had bought her dogs and her seven-year-old into the house. She was going back to get her two-year-old from the car when someone stormed up her driveway in a white BMW, this one. They attacked her, ran her over, and took the car with the two-year-old Isaiah inside. She called 911, convinced they wanted her little boy, but when police called Volkswagen Corp to utilize the GPS tracker in the car, they were told Taylor's free trial had expired and $150 was needed to help. So I didn't even think that that would be an issue, that Volkswagen would refuse to tell us where our son was, especially when it's a kidnapping and every second matters. It's life or death that we're going to get him home. In the days after the incident, VW issued this statement, quote, unfortunately, in this instance, there was a serious breach of the process. We are addressing the situation with the parties involved. Now, eventually, someone paid the $150, but by then, the child was found about 15 miles away, walking near a highway up in Waukegan. The family car was also found shortly after that. One month after the incident, VW offered free GPS tracking for all new cars for five years, but the company never reached out to Taylor or her family. The lawsuit stands. Live in the newsroom, Chris Ty, CBS 2 News. Chris, thanks so much.